Okay, so here's version two of the battery capacity tester. It's uh, in progress of checking battery. That's uh, one of these 18650s. Uh, it's all menu driven now. Uh, I'm now using a uh, a FET as a power resistor. And we're setting that through this 10 turn pot over here. So, and you can, you can set this on the fly as it's going just by turning this 10 turn pot. So, I can tweak it down to like 400. Uh, you can go all the way down to zero, all the way up to about uh, 800 milliamps. So, we just let it sit there. It's not current regulated, it's just a strict uh, straight power resistor, which is all we need in this case, uh, since the nano is calculating dynamically on the fly what the current consumption is across this resistor. So I have a cheap encoder from that I bought off of uh, Amazon, and that's also part of the sketch. Uh, you can actually drop out of this calculation, you can stop it, just by tapping the switch. Uh, and uh, in the menu option, you have the option of uh, setting the cutoff voltage or to, to start the, uh, uh, the measurement. So you just turn the, the rotary encoder to select which one you want. And we're going to continue. So if you already have a charge in pro progress and it hasn't completed, it will maintain where it is. So once you go back into it, you just pick right back up. And this will continue to discharge the battery until it's down to the dropout voltage that you set, currently three volts. Uh, and then it uh, displays the final capacity and resets the measurement. That's it.